Squarespace can be so sneaky sometimes. As a Circle member, we've been beta testing this really cool new design feature, and I was looking at a client website today, and it's available. They launched it. I had no idea it was available to the public. Check out the new icons you can have for your drop-down menu. Here's what they look like and how to turn them on. So check it out. Here inside Squarespace, we're going to hop into edit mode and then click on edit site header. Now click on your navigation. It'll be outlined in blue like this. And then you can click this edit icon to edit the navigation. There's a brand new design tab. And this is where you can turn on the icon feature. Now we've got 16 different icons to choose from. And then we've got some settings. So let's go ahead and start with this one right here. And I'll show you what these settings are. After that, we can change the style, making the size of it small medium or large, or you can click these three dots and set a custom value, whatever suits the style of your own unique site. You'll probably want to adjust this depending upon the font size and font family that you're using. Now, after you've adjusted the size, you can do the same thing with thickness, making it really thick or a little small. Notice that the triangle part of the arrow isn't changing, the other part is. And pay attention to that here when we talk about roundness, this last option. If I click this, it's going to round the corners. It'll round the end of the arrow. This leaves corners at 90 degrees. This rounds them. And then we have spacing in between that. Spacing changes the distance between the link and the arrow itself. Now, again, you've got a lot of different options to choose from. I like this arrow option. You can also choose a square, a circle, a line, a plus sign, but pay attention to what happens when you actually activate the dropdown. Now, you won't see this in edit mode, but we'll go back to this arrow here and I'll show you. Let's select save. We'll hop out of edit mode. And now when I hover over the dropdown, that arrow reverses. Did you see that? That's an action that happens with that unique icon. So depending upon what icon you choose, you might have a different action for what happens when you hover over it. Definitely a cool feature, right? Did you know this was coming? I had no idea they were ready to announce it and it totally made my day. What's a design feature that you wish they would share tomorrow? Let me know in the comments. Even if it's not in a beta test, I want to know. What's one cool design feature that you wish you could just click a magic button and it would happen in Squarespace? I want to know.